Musical Tic-Tac-Toe is a really fun and engaging game to play with your students who are just learning how to read music. The idea for your Tic-Tac-Toe is one that I got from the Fun Music Company, but it's easy to make your own Tic-Tac-Toe cards. You can even make a game with musical symbols or instruments to help your students learn these concepts. So to make your tic-tac-toe game, you will need a set of images with musical notes. I've gone ahead and shared a Dropbox link with these musical notes that are already ready. So we're going to go ahead and download them. You're going to download these notes onto your computer. Save this. Next we're going to go to our download folder and extract everything. So we should have our notes like this. Perfect. Alright, so now what we're going to do is we're going to go to a website called eslactivities.com slash pbingo.php Head over to this site and we'll see this is a bingo card maker. We're going, instead of making a bingo card, we're going to make a 3x3 three three tic-tac-toe card. So hit continue. Now this is where we're going to need the images that we just downloaded. So over here I have my bingo notes. I'm going to select all of them and then drag them into the space here for my images. And as you can see, I've got all of my images here. In total, there are 16 images. You only need nine, of course, for your tic-tac-toe, but you can make several different tic-tac-toe cards and then see which one you'd like to give to your students. Next, you can choose a number of cards. Like I said, uh, if you don't like this particular card, you can choose to make Let's choose to make four cards. We don't need a free space because we're playing tic-tac-toe, we're not actually playing bingo. The letter paper size is great, so we'll continue on here. Now here you have an option to either have uh, call cards or flashcards. It's not really necessary to have either of those because these with the clue names is actually again for bingo. So we're just going to go, you can either print directly here or save. So let's click the all cards and save that and then you will see we will have our bingo cards generated which are actually going to be used for our tic-tac-toe games. So I've got a set of four different tic-tac-toe cards right here that I can print off and use for my students. Let's see an example of a musical tic-tac-toe game in action. So this is a B. This is a... A. Very good. Uh, C. This is an F. Nope, not quite. The F is on the line. Comes after F. It's F A C E. Right. E F G. Very good. Oh, I'm gonna go. Uh, uh, D. F. I win. Oh, you win. <laughs> Anyway, I hope you liked this tutorial. Please like, comment, and subscribe to the video, and I'll see you on the next one.